He's so broken! Look at him just back toward the like, like that! Guaranteed damage! This year we're not getting one, not three, but two brawlers! <laughs> Grom will be unlockable on the 23rd if you can hit nine wins on the challenge with pretty much free continues. It's one gem. Look at that backpack. I think he's got a Russian accent. Must remember bring walkie-talkie. Must remember bring walkie-talkie. My guy Grom looks like Pam. If you throw it closer, it, it almost goes off immediately. You can hit them from pretty far away too. Look at that. Uh. Look at that. It does take a lot longer to travel, much like all the other throws. But if you're right beside them, you can just auto-aim all three of them. One ball is going to hit 1,500. You can't stack them. So even if you'd perfectly center it, only one ball is going to hit for 1,500 damage. But it pierces. Look at that. Look at the distance of that. If I center it just perfectly, I can get the two on the left and the two on the right. Oh, that's butamus. His attack doesn't seem to be able to deal more than one row, though. So if I do it right here, it doesn't. it's not going to get the bottom row and the top row. What's his DPS? Oh, we can get 4,500. I mean, yeah, that, yeah, that, that makes, makes sense. sense. It's super, though. Look how big and devastating it is. Oh, my, this hits the cross the whole screen. My goodness. I reckon we could probably break the wall. Yeah, it breaks the wall. But does that, does it go that far? Oh, my goodness. Ain't no way it travels across the map like that. Wait. Does it actually? Okay, it's not that far. It's still, that's pretty crazy. Does it dissipate? When it hits the wall, it does. So the wall stops it completely for the first one. So you can't just pierce the wall and then just wreck them. But you can wreck them and then pierce the wall. You've got uh, his gadget, which is literally just a watchtower. So you can see inside the bushes there. And it decays slowly. Look at that. It just wrecks that. And I pretty much have a watchtower of the entire map. Taking out two boxes at once? My goodness. That's a bad placement. I'm going to place it a little bit lower. Look at that. Now I see everyone and everything. I'm going to camp the right side. Ain't no way he's getting through. Ain't no way. Oh, this is this is actually so satisfying. Lighting every single shot. Sprout, you ain't got nothing on me. You can't dodge that. Oh, my goodness. Oh, he's BMing me. His first star power gains 15% faster movement speed when he's fully charged. That is significantly faster. I didn't even think I would notice, but you saw it here first, folks. X Factor deals 30% more damage at maximum distance. So normally it deals 1500. Yeah, 1500 there. Maximum distance. 1950. Wow. 1799. So it scales. Oh, that's cool. I was wondering what they're going to define as maximum distance. 1950 is the maximum, though. This doesn't increase, does it? Yeah, no, it's 2500 all across the board. We got to do Cavern Churn. We don't know what a second gadget is, but we do know his first one is going to give us this massive sentry. Maybe I'll just wreck that Lou instead. Oh, no. Maybe that Lou's going to wreck me. I am getting wrecked. Why are these plots so good? Oh, safety. Silly Brock. So let's get into our first match. Totally our first match. What? Are you serious? You're joking. Get that bull out of here. That's guaranteed. He's going to be so good in Cavern Churn. Oh, the second star power is going to be so useful. Now I can open them in three hits instead of four. I love how I can just clear all of that. Get out of here, B. Oh, what was that? I melted her. He's so good. I don't recognize Pierced. I don't recognize Gem Source, but they look kind of cool. Oh, that's right. I have a healing gear. I am a turret now. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. I could just do that. That's so OP. Oh, no. Oh, my goodness. That's rigged. Look, I, we, we have the full right side covered. Leon ain't no way he's dodging that. That's actually so annoying. I love this. Grom is insane. We love Grom. Wait, wait. We're not ending it just yet. No, I got the power up. I got the power up. <laughs> oh, Leon. That's... Oh, I, I got the Leon and the Amber. You're joking. They're done. They're not going to dodge this. Look how massive that is. Oh my. What the f***? How? How? That's so strong. I almost dropped the F-bomb. <laughs> what? With freaking roughs? That's insane. Okay. Pierce looks really weird. This looks like kind of like a sniper thrower map. We got to try this. Oh my. Oh. Oh. Is this a Grom map? Is this a Rico map? It was written on your forehead. Are we going to get Nita? <laughs> we got Nita from there. Oh, that's great. Look at the scouting proximity. That's just ridiculous. So ideally, I could hit right there just because that's the cross section. Oh, my goodness. That ain't even fair. 
Okay, Lola, don't do that. That's dumb. Why would you do that? Um, Gale, don't do that too. Gale, excuse me, Gale. He's bought teammates. What is this? Power League and gold rank? They're like randoms. Wow. I don't know how I got that Nina, but we got him. Holy freaking heck. <laughs> I got so confused. I thought those were my buttons. Can they just die already? Lola, stop grabbing the gems if you're going to die, please. All right, what happens with the auto aim? Uh, auto aim is actually not bad. I just got them all with auto aim. Yeah. Oh, my. oh, he is made for feast or famine. Kind of ish. Oh, wait. Oh, his gadget. Redo, redo. His gadget's going to be so good on here. Forget all that noise. Oh, well oiled tick. More like well dead tick. Where's my guy? What the frick? Jackie, stop. Where's my teammate? Tara, where were you when I needed you? I wrecked middle so hard. All right, let's see what auto aim does. Did she just super the turret? I'm actually so cheesed. Oh, well, look at that. Auto aim just actually works against bots. He's not going to be like Barley that deals massive DPS to the safe. But all throwers are really good in heist. Don't quote me on that. I actually don't know what I'm talking about. Wait, can I just do this all day, every day? I could. That's so funny. Uh, Mr. P, it'd be nice if you did something. Oh, my, what the frick was that? What the frick was that? What the frick was that? Oh, no. Don't, don't, don't super that way. That just breaks the walls that you're hiding in. Oh, wow. It's really, really hard to defend against him in this map. Plus, it doesn't help that his attack pierces, so they can't body block it. How is that fair? How is that fair? I'm going to back off, and I'm going to do one top. Look at that. He's actually good in heist against bots. We'll see when he comes out in the game in the 23rd. Be sure to check out my live streaming channel on the 23rd. I will be streaming him at 2 a.m. Again, that streaming channel is Orange Juice Live. Cube Force. So from this distance, I should be able to clear half of that grass. We got the mortise in there. So if I do this, I pretty much cover that whole vertical. Ain't no way he's dodging that. Ain't no way. What the frick, Sprout? I'm not having a good time right now. The mortise hard counters us. What was that bot mortis doing? You know what? I'm just going to watch these bots do their thing. They're wilding right now. Oh, last second comeback. Why don't I do that? Back, 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 back. Oh, look, his losing animation. Binary coding. I do not recognize this map. Oh, why am I so good? Why am I so good? Did I make the bot waste their super too? That's amazing. All right. We spin on them. We spin on the Meg because we know the Meg can't do anything. We spin on her. We spin on her. Then we score. It's all about that BM life. I really like split. Man, if I had real teammates there, it would have been in proper positions. I'm supposed to just cover from over here. <laughs> My turret of justice. I can see them coming a mile away. What are you doing, Penny? What are you doing, Penny? Turret is actually so good. Holy freaking heck. That Amber is so done. He has so much burst damage potential. This is amazing. Combined with his super for wall breaking abilities, he's so versatile. He's actually really good at scouting the grass. Essentially, if you put it in the center, you're guaranteed to scout the two by two tiles across that entire row. And if you put it down the super, it's like anyone that's in the grass is done. Hello there, Rosa. How do you do? You don't do. That's the problem, Rosa. Surprise. Watch this. It's going to hit her. Look at that. I am not dealing any damage. She is wrecking me so hard. I'm not, I'm not dealing any damage, damage to this, Rosa. This is, this is actually such a joke. Come on. Oh my goodness. In a 3v3 situation when I can hit three targets at once, just burst the team out. But I'm by myself against the Rosa with that healing bush star power. Oh man. Nuts and bolts. It's classic. Wait, can I hit the siege from here? I can. I'm hitting the Ike from here. I've brought it down 62% so far. Fifth. Ain't no way. Spike. Holy frick. It's it's down to 30%. I can just throw it from there. This is so cheese. It's 4% now. I brought it down all. This is like sprout backdooring, except he actually deals a decent amount of damage. 5% every time and you can't avoid that. Oh my goodness. They're going to nerf this. There's no way. There's no way. Look at that. And then every time they respawn, I, I end up hitting them anyways because it pierces. They can't body block this like they can with Sprout. Imagine if I had a Sprout teammate to cheese on this map. Oh, wait. Oh, no, that was my turret. Scared me a bit. How long did that take? 30 seconds? A minute? 
The Sprout, you have to angle it very carefully. For perspective, Sprout does 1470. He did 1500, plus splashed everything around it and was guaranteed to hit the Ike every single time. Optimism is lack of information.